TFNN Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes filling in for Tom O'Brien. This is the 9 a.m. update. As of 9 a.m., you've got Dow Equity Futures off 100 points. They're trading out at 26,783. S&P Futures off 8.5. NASDAQ down 35. Russell 2000 off about 5 points. Gold's up 6 bucks. Uh, silver up 11 pennies. Here's what we're going to want to watch during the day, and here's the reasons why. First of all, if we take a look at the uh, general market, we use the New York Stock Exchange. Uh, what we can see out here is that there's a divergence. These divergences typically lead to retracements or tops out here. So it's time to pay attention. We can see that price has been moving higher. Uh, that's shown here in the upper right-hand corner if you're watching this on Tiger TV. If not, uh, I'm just letting you know that price is trading above the high from June 20th. On June 20th, the advanced decline oscillator reading inside the New York Stock Exchange, that's a difference between two exponential moving averages, 39 and 19, of the advanced decline data uh, made its high. Price moved higher inside the New York Stock Exchange, but the advanced decline data, our oscillator, its market breadth has made a lower high out there. And that's always a potential problem. Now, it's not so much a problem because that oscillator reading remains above zero. It closed on Friday at 96.12. If it were to get below zero, that becomes a different story. Anticipate a further decline. If we take a look at equity futures contracts, what is it that you're going to be watching today? You're going to be watching the Dow equity futures contract as one of the signals. You're going to be watching the price point of really 26,762. A close below that suggests that price may go back to 26,672, maybe even 26,596, where it could form its next Gartley buy pattern out there. But at this stage, watch the price level of 26,762. That's in the Dow Equity Futures contract. That's coming from its two hour time frame. For the ES Mini, the level to be watching there is going to be 2976 or 2982 as we speak right now. Price must close under that in order for us, us to get a price projection of 29.63. In other words, key levels of support, those are the numbers I just provided you. And inside the NQ, the number out here you're going to be watching today is 77.97 and a quarter. Those are the price points that price must close below in order for the market to begin moving to the downside. So, folks, thanks for being here. Stay tuned for another great programming hour. Larry Pesavento, he's coming up next. Have a magical Monday. This is Steve Rhodes. We'll see you soon.